This review is going to move a call to spy. I'm the anger guy. I'm going to tell you like it is. Director for the film A Call to Spy was Lydia Dean Pilchard. Ms. Pilchard has won two Emmy Awards. She has written many scripts for TV shows, movies, and from a number of books. Lydia got her feet wet in directing when she co-directed the film Radium Girls. Her first solo directorial debut was the film A Call to Spy. The writer of script for the film A Call to Spy was Sarah Megan Thompson, who also stars in the film. The film was about the start and execution of female operative spies on the Allied side, where some of them, in cooperation with resistance groups, had great importance on the outcome of the war in France. The story is true, intense and inspiring. It adds a level of understanding about World War II which hasn't been explored in film before. Early 1940s, the German Nazi threat was nearly at its peak during World War II, with Britain becoming desperate. Churchill, out of necessity after the fall of France to Nazi, secretly orders his new spy agency, SOE, Special Operation Executive, to recruit, train, brave women, from England and then send the courageous women spies on their missions. The story centers around three courageous women, Vera Atkins, the recruiter, Virginia Hall, the American, and Nora Inetta Khan, who became the best wireless operator. Stana Kadic as Vera Atkins was a Romanian Jewish immigrant in London who was in charge of the program SOE to recruit talented women to become spies. While recruiting, Vera was especially looking for people who could become a wireless operator because it was such a hard and dangerous position to fill. Sarah Megan Thomas, a producer and writer of the script to the film A Call of Spy, also portrayed Virginia Hall, who was an American that always wanted to be a diplomat but couldn't for years because of her prosthetic leg. Atkins recruited her in the program against the wishes of nearly all her colleagues. Virginia was an enthusiastic woman who spoke fluent French. Because of her and doing her job so well, Miss Hall was enemy number one to the Gestapo. Also, Rahel Ayat portrayed Nora in a con. Miss Nora was literally a princess born of India and Russian parents. With her intelligence, she was trained as wireless operator. After training, she was in high demand to fill position quickly. Often terrified, hounded, chased by Nazis, Nora was determined to get the word out over the wire even while crouching in a basement or an attic as Nazi police were pounding on the door. Virginia Hall and Nora and Akan were dropped in France with forged papers, with elaborate cover stories, and almost no organization support from back home. They were on their own. Vera Atkins, Virginia Hall, and Nora Enakon were inspirational characters which illustrated courage, dedication, and self-sacrifice. What can I say? This story had to be told about all the brave women who was inspired by real events and, believe it or not, all who took this challenge that are dead or survived are some of the bravest people on the planet because they were real Allied spies in World War II which helped to change the course of the world. Out of an alphabetic score, I give the film a call to spy a solid B. Thank you for watching and thank you for commenting. Thank you.